This is how to handle a narcissist with grace when you hate them. Narcissists don't say sorry. They wait until you're done with it. When you're sorry for something you did, you say, I'm sorry. However, regret is a bad emotion that makes us believe we did something wrong when something bad did happen. Narcissists don't want to be responsible or take the blame, even if they did something wrong. Since they can't understand how other people feel, people who don't have empathy are quick to blame others and let them deal with their own grief. Narcissists don't care about other people and try to avoid feeling bad about what they did, so they will never say sorry in a way that shows they are sorry. It's not possible to beat an ego at its own game. I'll show you how to get rid of narcissists for good today, and it won't hurt you. First though, I'd like to thank you for seeing this movie. Please share this movie with your friends, family, and other people you care about. It will really help this channel grow. Just in case you're here for the first time, please subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any changes. Thank you for your help. Let's start. The first thing you should do is realize that trying to force or support the ego to change will not work. Instead, work on getting better and making more friends. If we haven't gotten help for our codependency or are just beginning to, we could become too reliant on other people, which is bad for us. We don't have the power to change how other people see us, what happens, or how things turn out. It makes us sick to try to do that. They would have worked hard to change their behavior by now if that was their goal. Make your life your own again by deciding to do what it takes to be the best person you can be. It doesn't matter who the narcissist is. Do something about your life because you are the only one who can change it. Stop focused on the narcissist as soon as possible and start working on yourself. Your life will get better. Being and living your best life is the best way to get rid of a narcissist. 2. Taking a break from the fight. Staying away from a narcissist is the only way to beat them. Besides that, it's not worth the time. Why? You can never win when you deal with these people. Leave the fights, arguments, and never-ending battles of wills, please. Let them have the last word. They'll think they won after this. You will protect your life force energy and your health if you leave. In the short and long run, you win. Don't pay attention to what harmful people like narcissists and their friends say. Number three, telling an ego what you want will only make things worse. Prepare yourself. I'm about to tell you the harsh truth. You should leave because the jerk doesn't care about you. These people don't care about what you think, feel or need even if it's good for you and fair. That's the truth, even though it's hard to believe. Take care of yourself in the way you think is best. They can't give you what you want. Don't expect other people to meet your wants anymore. You need to take care of yourself. Once the narcissist is gone, you'll no longer need them and will be able to be yourself again. You need to do this right if you want to meet people who are loved, healthy and good for both of you. When you understand you are no longer tied to a codependent relationship, you can start to heal. You are now free to make healthy adult connections. You deserve it, so you can keep it. 4. Figure out how to keep your mind and body safe. If you want to get away from narcissists' projections, you need to learn how to control your feelings and be close to God. In case they want to come over, and press a button for fun, you can stop them. Take great care of yourself if you want to deal with your ego in a chic and sure way. They work best if you use them every day and make them a part of your daily life. It's tough to compete with a narcissist's confidence and style if we're not used to taking care of ourselves. It makes sense that we're having trouble in this area after being blamed for so long. When you wake up the next morning, you'll be in charge of your whole life. Take care of yourself first. You are the only one who needs to do it.
Please let me know in the comments if you are going to make any of these changes. 5. Don't feel bad about your ego. People who like narcissists are more likely to believe the crap they say, even if it's not their own. Even worse, they won't understand how you feel, which will make you feel lied to, helpless and beaten. People who are empaths can pick up on other people's bad vibes and low vibrations, even if they don't have them themselves. A hangover is not worth the trouble for people who care a lot. Be nice to the narcissist from afar instead, and worry about yourself and other loving, kind people. 6. Talk to people you trust. If you want to get over a narcissist with style and confidence, you need strong support. This is because you need to get over the abuse first. You need to get it if you don't already have it. You should talk to people you trust about your problems. This person could be an expert in the area or a friend, family member or neighbour that you trust. But that doesn't mean we should treat these people like trash cans and keep dumping our problems and bad feelings on them. It means you'll have a place to go when you want to be understood and agreed upon. Being abused by a narcissist makes it impossible to heal on your own. You need strong support. It would be good for everyone if we could talk about our issues with someone. This is why you need to get together with some people who can help you feel better. You will be less likely to try to get these things from people you don't trust or who might hurt you if they found out. Don't forget that you are in charge of your health and well-being. Find healthy ways to meet your goals. We need to build and keep a strong network of support over time in order to do this. That's all I have to say today. Thanks for coming today. I hope this movie teaches you something. Tell us about your experience with a narcissist if you've been with one. If you want to see more videos from us, you could subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon below the video. Thanks a lot.